Okay, so I was getting ready to do this uh, promotional photo, and I texted Chris saying I'm going to do a promo shot to put on our Wakeham subreddit. And he emails me this letter that he says is from his manager, which he, I know he doesn't have. I'm guessing it's from his girlfriend, but there's a couple lines in here that I, I think he just busted in my gut for no reason. It says, Jay, while you're editing the promotional material, I would like for you to make some subtle changes to the appearance of Chris Kerr which is in third person, but I'm still thinking that he wrote this. I have made a checklist of Chris's appearance should be's, in quotes. If these aren't carefully made, then you will not be allowed to use Chris's face in the materials of mailers, online, promotional, or any other type of release. I still think that this is him just being Chris. Um, It's annoying, but that's all right. So Chris Kerr must appear taller than me in every picture or shot, which he is taller than me, so I don't know why he says that. Chris Kerr must have the appearance of a full beard, and I don't know what, if he thinks he has not a full beard or not, but now I've got to fill in his beard or something. Uh, Chris Kerr must have the appearance of tan skin, which is stupid. Maybe because he went to Costa Rica, he feels like he, he has to be tan now or something. Chris Kerr must have a half smile with none of his teeth showing. That doesn't even make sense. Chris Kerr must have the appearance of someone who frequents the gym. He cannot have a belly or flat arms, and he doesn't go to the gym. Chris Kerr's shirt must appear faded, which always does because he always wears these old nasty shirts. This is subject to change and something, something. So anyways, I, I kind of wish I didn't even email him or text him because I could have just probably been done with this already. And I'm just putting it on, on a subreddit probably and nobody's going to see it. But this is now rules that I have to follow, so I don't even know why. Um, so half of these rules don't really apply. Like, let's see, uh, he's um, frequents the gym. It doesn't matter. He's got a that Carhartt thing on and then his shirt's faded already but what I'm going to do is go ahead and make him look a little more tan fill in his beard just do some of these stupid things that he's asked Um, and then I can post it and I don't know I kind of don't think he actually can't do anything like what's he going to say but okay so let's go ahead and make him a little darker Uh, that'll look good okay and then um, we'll go ahead and fill in his beard a little too uh, let's do brush, 38. Go ahead and do a couple clicks, that way it gets, uh, it's got the kind of bumps versus a smooth. So we'll fill in his beard. Uh, it actually looks kind of cool. Um, so that looks pretty good actually, and then let's put a background image in. Whoops. Yeah, it looks fine. Place. Put below him. This is what I was going to do anyways, just not with this um, color thing and the full beard, but it doesn't look that bad, honestly. So I can't really complain to him, although I I should. Uh, What am I doing here? Oh yeah, selection. Come up with all these stupid rules just to give me a hard time. Alright, so there we go. Go around, there we go. So now, ooh, it would be funny if it said Waco. Now, what else I have to do? I have to appear to smile with none of his teeth showing? What the heck? Okay, so we'll do a healing. Yeah, so we'll kind of close this, we'll make it. Oh my gosh. Ooh, that's creepy looking. You just want me to make your face look better, but I just want to punch in, I want to punch you in the face, Chris. Okay, so that's healed up. Now let's go ahead and draw like kind of a weird smile in there. Almost the wrong way. Um, yeah, it looks actually kind of good. Let's do like an off red for his lips. Okay, so we've got his smile. We got his full beard. He's taller than me doesn't apply. Skin is darker. Well, okay. Guess it's gonna have to work. So that's our episode. Just trying to make a promo up thing with Chris's weird diva demands. Okay.